because my mum used to be so full of advice. But like, like the really annoying kind of advice, like, um, we'll kill him with kindness. <laughs> a messy room, he calls a messy mind. Uh, high school's the best time of your life. <laughs> high school, it's the best time of your life. <laughs> I'll tell that to uh, Patrick Sharp, who uh, used to sit next to me in maths, and he once, <laughs> he once got so excited that he knew the answer to x squared plus pi that as he raised his arm he gasped so hard that he sucked up all my hair and he nearly choked himself <laughs> and I actually don't know who that was more embarrassing for him or me but I mean he did he did get called Henry the Hoover for six years after that so uh yeah probably him <laughs> um or to my mate Ronnie, who once <laughs> pissed herself on a trampoline in PE, which actually isn't funny. It's really, it's really traumatising. Um, or to Nathan Smith, who once sat on a little blob of hydrochloric acid in chemistry and uh, burnt a hole in his trousers. <laughs> straight through to his bare bum cheek. Yeah, and you, you yeah. You don't want to know what nickname he got for that. Um, or me. Um, sitting on my own in a toilet cubicle at lunchtime. Um, eating my sandwiches. That was um, after she died. Um, my mum and I just couldn't bear eating lunch with everybody else talking about what boys they fancied or what they were going to wear for the school disco like I just lost my best friend in the whole world. <laughs> and I remember telling my mum about Patrick <laughs> hoovering up my hair. <laughs> we just both <laughs> pissed ourselves for ages <laughs> until we were both in tears. <sighs> Fuck, sorry. <laughs> Sorry, that, uh, that got way, way more intense than I thought it was going to. <laughs> <laughs>